This is a short introduction on basic evaluation functions in the Vsense Analytical 1 software. Go to the button bar and click the Evaluation button. The Evaluation module opens and a pseudocolor image of the last recording is displayed. In the upper left corner you will find the button for loading images. If you want to load a whole series of images, check the box next to it. The directory of the current session will be opened. Select the first recording and press open. In the next dialog you can type in the number of images you want to load. In this case we want all 45 images of our time series measurement to be loaded. In the upper right of the screen are the buttons for different display options. You can, for example, display 16 images at a time on the evaluation screen. Use the slide number bar to switch to the next 16 images. You can also display four images at a time and again slide back and forth. Most of the time you might want to work with a single image displayed. Here you can also use the slide number bar to change to another image of your time series. In the min-max bar you can see the minimum and maximum values displayed on the evaluation screen. These values are set automatically, but if you want to change, you can simply type in the minimum and maximum values you want displayed. You will have to click on one of the display buttons to apply the changes. In the side-by-side -side view, two images can be displayed next to each other. Here, the first and last image of our time series measurement are displayed. You can find the respective image information below. To compare other images, you can type the respective image number next to the side-by-side -side icon and then click on it. Alpha blending is another display function. Here, the original image is displayed on the upper left, the processed image on the lower left. A blended image of the two is displayed on the right. The evaluation function set axis profiles will calculate and display a graph of average values in a certain region of interest. And this for all uploaded images. You are able to select the region of interest with left mouse clicks. Close the polygon with a final right mouse click. You can save this data if you want to. The software has calculated average values in the ROI for all images and displays the respective graph. Clicking on the pseudo button will get you back to the pseudo color display of the respective image you had selected before. The function ROI statistics will calculate and show statistical values for the selected region of interest. Statistical information is shown next to the ROI and also displayed in a color bar at the lower right screen. Switch back to the pseudo color display. You can also display the color bar for the current image by clicking the respective box. Here the ratio is displayed. To get oxygen values and percent air saturation you will have to perform a calibration. You can see how to perform a calibration in our calibration video.